Unfortunately, millions of children all across the world are starving right now. That's right. To help combat the malnutrition these children face, the Feed My Starving Children organization teamed up with Boyd Buchanan and other volunteers to send food to those in need. News Channel 9's Drew Balea has the story. A total of four semi trucks just like these arrived late Wednesday night and they're carrying enough food to feed 4,000 starving children every day for an entire year. And through these doors, there's thousands of volunteers packing up raw supplies to be shipped out. Entering the Boyd Buchanan School gym, you hear music and shouts of joy. The assembly line system of students pumps out box after box with 216 meals in each container. This makes me feel good packing food for hungry children. Landon Deal is 10 years old. He says he enjoys helping children just like him, except they're hungry. Just go to the pantry and grab something. But these children can't do, it. can't do that. The volunteers pack each bag with scientifically engineered ingredients full of nutritional value. You can't give a starving kid a cheeseburger. It doesn't work that way. He needs to have the nutritional value, so we have rice, vitamins, vegetable, and soy. And they will pack more than 1.5 million meals, and we are just happy to get to be a part of that. Boyd Buchanan President Jill Hartness jumped on the idea of hosting the feeding frenzy. And, um, I just am so grateful that we can provide this service to our community and really globally to our world. It's kids serving kids. It's, a, it's an amazing thing. While helping hungry kids in Haiti, these children gain a greater appreciation for their own lives. I can't imagine how, how horrible it is for those children out there, but they're going to get this food. After all, 1.5 million bags of food have been packed and shipped out. There's still an opportunity for you to donate. The Covenant Values Foundation, based here in Chattanooga, will match two for one for every dollar donated. And keep in mind, just one of these can feed four children. In Chattanooga, Drew Balea, News Channel 9. In Haiti, a staggering 67% of the population goes without food some days, can't afford a balanced diet, or has limited access to food. That's according to surveys by the government's National Coordination of Food Security. The packing at Boyd Buchanan will continue through Sunday night. If you'd like to get involved or donate, just go to newschannel9.com and click on this story.